2021. I did play just one mid scope. Well, I'm even higher yesterday, better than Poke and the Eye, and that's enough to keep them at all time highs. Well, let's let's start kissing each other just yet. Unfortunately, futures are getting whacked pre market, so it's going to be a pretty ugly open. How's that for an oxymoron from a trend? Following Moron. NASDAQ opening gap reversal did manage to close in Flatsville, and that keeps it right at all time highs, but it too will likely get whacked on the open. Russell remains a big disappointment in here. Back chart way out, and as you can see, it's traded sideways for a long, long, long time. Ideally, you know me, I should like to make new highs and not look back one day at a time. Unfortunately, if it continues to drop it here, all of this will become overhead. Supply still kind of mixed throughout. Energies have been losing steam as of late. Some areas like leisure not doing so hot. Retail though, banging on new highs with a little bit of vigor. Still look like a top remains in place in the transport, but software, hardware at brand new highs in here. Take a look at Stimmy though, stalling out a little bit yesterday. So what I'm trying to say, it's pretty mixed out there. And based on today's open, be really careful. Maybe look for an opening gap reversal if you're a little more aggressive. Any questions, David, DaveLander.com. Ooh, ooh, chart show tonight. Hope to see you there. I'm going to flesh all this out in a lot more detail. I'm Dave Landry. You just heard a minute.